let's simplify this question we'll first simplify the variables inside this fifth root so let's write fifth root of l power 2 minus 7 we are using the rule 1 here and we have the l on top and bottom and same thing with m so let's write m power 4 minus 2 over we are just left with 96 on the bottom now in our next step we have fifth root of we can write l power 2 minus 7 is minus 5 times m power 4 minus 2 is 2 over 96 now we can use the rule 2 here and bring that l down and let's also separate fifth root so that's fifth root of m square over fifth root of 96 times l power 5 our next step we have fifth root of m square that remains same over we'll separate fifth root between those terms here so fifth root of we can split 96 to 32 times 3 times fifth root of l power 5 in our next step we have fifth root of m square over we'll separate fifth root again between 32 and 3 times fifth root of l power 5 will strike out fifth root and 5 and we are left with l now we have fifth root of m square over fifth root of 32 is nothing but 2 because 32 is a 2 power 5 times fifth root of 3 times l this is our final answer